A cruise on Dauphin Island are planning for the worst and hoping for the best. Mm -hmm. They've assembled a four-mile-long wall that's designed to protect the shore and soak up any oil that might come through. Fox News reporter Libby Amos has more on the project on Dauphin Island. The group charged with protecting Dauphin Island's shoreline from oil demonstrated how its plan will work if it's needed. Our project here, we were assigned by BP and the ADEM to actually apply a food grade polymer, which basically is used in IV bags, medical instruments, tires, or it's used to enhance oils. Dan Parker is the president of CI Solutions, the company that manufactures an oil absorbing chemical. To show how it works, he poured diesel fuel into a water tank, then applied the chemical and was able to pick up the oil in a big glob. He says it's completely safe. This will not hurt animals, people, humans. You can eat it. It's not very tasty. If the oil comes close to the island, the chemical will be injected into each of these units. They say it's okay that water passes through the wall onto the beach because the chemical will trap all of the oil inside the wall. Even though the producers of the wall and the chemical agent are convinced their product will work, there's still no plan to put it in place on the Gulf side of the West End. They say the surf is just too strong. The Army National Guard has been responsible for building the wall, and it stretches nearly four miles along the shoreline. On Dauphin Island, Libby Amos, Fox 10 News. The producer of the chemicals said he was moved for Louisiana at the request at Governor Bob Riley.